The most important aspect of a mile race is pace. You don't want to go out too fast. You don't want to go out too slow. You want to run a pace that you can maintain over the whole course of the race. The best miles are run when you are evenly paced. That's why you run interval workouts. So you could know what pace you can do over the entire course of the race so that you will optimize your performance. The worst thing you could do, like I said, is go out too fast. I'm gonna demonstrate what a four minute mile pace looks like. Look at the leg movement. Look at how quickly the legs are moving. Look at the arms, how quickly they're moving. This is very fast. Look at how the, the high knee lift. You do not wanna go at this pace. So that was four minute pace. Now I'm gonna show what six minute pace would look like. So you can see, look at my legs, how quickly or how slowly they're, they're moving. Compare the two so that you could work on your cadence. And remember, work on this in practice. And the longer the interval that you run in practice, the better the indicator is as to what you could run. Anybody can go out and run eight 200s in a quick pace, but that doesn't mean you can carry it for a mile. My recommendation is, run intervals of at least 600 meters, preferably 800 meters. And that will give you a really good judge as to what pace you could run for a mile. So here's the six minute pace. You can see the knees are not going up quite as high. Uh, the leg movement is not quite as quick. The arm movement is not quite as quick. This is still a very fast pace. So if you are not trained to run this pace, don't do it. But if you are trained and you feel like you want to uh, challenge yourself a little bit, then go for it.